This year in the season, there will be three major blockbusters that draw moviegoers to the cinema. The glorious names are Startup, Ashfall, and Forbidden Dream. The movie Startup is about a happening when rebellious Taegil and his friend Sang Pil came across the mysterious bobbed hair cook Ko Sok from the Chinese restaurant. Taegil and Sang Pil dropped out of high school and they both decided to make a living there from scratch. Startup is based on the popular webtoon of the same name. The movie even garnered a rate of 9.8. The cast include Ma Dong Seok, Park Jong Min, Jong Hae In, and Yeom Jung Ah. Their acting was incredibly in sync from the original, and their ensemble is definitely unmissable. Ashfall, also known as Mountain Pack 2, released on the 19th. The movie is based on the imaginary eruption from the Pack 2 mountain and wipe off the entire Korea. Therefore, people from both sides try to stop the pandemonium. The bank of a movie star from Assassination, along with the gods, the two were. And it's a sequel along with the gods that lasts 49 days. Ha Jong-woo and his co-actor Lee Byung-on, who plays the role of North Korean agent, will prove their brilliant chemistry. To be cherry on top, actress Chun Hye-jin, Bae Soo-ji, along with the actor Ma Dong-seok, will spice up the perfection of the movie. The day after the Christmas, on the 26th, the movie Forbidden Dream is scheduled to be released. It is about story between the two major figures, King Sejong and Chang Yongshil, who are longing to create the sky and the time of Joseon Dynasty. The two main characters encounter drew attention since it has been 20 years from the movie title The Shiri. The actor Choi Min Sik, who played impeccable acting in the role of Lee Sun Shin in the Admiral Roaring Current, now plays as Chang Yongshil. The co-actor Han Seok Kyu, who proved his film presence in Tree with Deep Roots, now now plays as King Sejong. Three respective characteristics movies are about to present themselves before the audiences. Last year in the movie, there was Swing Kids, Drug King, Take Point did not make it through to the top spot at the box office. The cinemas after a huge snowstorm of Frozen 2, many pay close attention if Korean movies can maintain their dignity and make it to the success.